A lawsuit may be in the works after the board chairman of the St. Landry Parish Housing Authority says he was wrongfully terminated by the parish president. The parish council, however, voted not to reinstate him in the council meeting tonight. News 10's Zabrit Lafaso spoke with the now former chairman who says he should have never been fired and plans to fight his termination. And just behind these doors, this housing commissioner was hoping he'd get a chance to be reinstated, but that did not happen. Beyond a shadow of a doubt, my services was rendered accurately. A housing commissioner for 31 years, Willie Haynes III pleaded with the parish council to reappoint him as board chairman of the parish housing authority. This coming a month after parish president Jesse Bellard fired him. I feel that it's the best interest that I appoint another member to take your place. Bellard says Haynes was negligent at his duties as the board chairman. In the end, the parish council agreed. I think he made he made a, a major mistake, you know, and I was willing to uh, correct any mistakes that I, that I may have made uh, uh, that I was not knowledgeable about. VP of Commissioners for the Louisiana Housing Council, Greg Johnson, who went to bat for Haynes, says this was never about job performance. In my opinion, this is politics at its best, and I feel like it, it had nothing to do with negligence of duties. Parish President Jesse Bellard sticking to his gun, saying Haynes did not properly do inspections. I don't pay politics. If anybody knows me, they know that right now. It's a very simple thing. Either they do it or they don't do it. Whether you in politics or not, we don't have time. We don't have the, the money to waste on politics. Bellard says now the search begins to fill Haynes' position. Reporting in St. Landry Parish, Brett LaFosso, KLFY News 10.